Hey everyone, I'm Kavita and welcome back to my YouTube channel Sparkle Kavi. Today I'm going to show you how to make this origami side fold pencil pouch. Trust me friends, it's lot easier to make than how difficult it looks from outside. And it could be a nice quick birthday return gift to make. So let's see how to make this pencil pouch. You are going to need main fabric which is 9 inch wide and 11 inch long, lining fabric of same measurement. Then you are also going to need lightweight fusible interfacing of same measurement as main fabric. Then a fabric strip of approximately 2 inch by 8 inch long for binding raw edges, 13 to 14 inch long zipper and a zipper pull. Some any fabric to add side tabs, it's just 2 inch wide fabric folded in half twice like bias binding uh, with stitches on both the folded sides. It's optional, if you don't want you can skip the tabs. You can even use ribbon for side tabs. So to begin first fuse interfacing to the wrong side of the fabric. I have already fused my fabric. Now lay your main fabric with right side facing up then place the zipper with right side of zipper facing down on the longest side of fabric and lastly place the lining fabric with right side facing down toward the zipper, align all the three together and pin. Then make a stitch all the way down to attach zipper. Open the fabric and finger press the seam and make a top stitch. Now lay the other side of main fabric on zipper, clip them, flip it over and place the lining on the zipper. Align all the sides, pin and give a stitch all the way down. Then turn the fabric right side out and top stitch the other side of zipper. Now insert the zipper pull into the zipper and turn the fabric inside out. By holding the zipper tape, fold the fabric in half to get the center point. Now mark it with pen or make a little notch with scissor. And again fold the two sides in half and make notches to get the center of them. Repeat the same for the opposite side also. Now first lay the fabric flat then fold both the sides inside so that all the three notches meet at the center of the zipper tape. Clip them in place. Repeat the same for the opposite side also. Now 
trim the extra zipper from both the sides. Next, take the side tabs, fold them in half and make a stitch at open ends to hold them in place. Now insert the tabs with folded side inside right next to zipper in center and then with quarter inch seam make a stitch. Repeat the same for the opposite side also. If you want you can definitely skip the side tabs but side tabs really help to move the zipper pull easily. Now take your binding fabric cut it in half then lay your binding fabric flat with right side facing up then place the pouch approximately in the center then wrap the binding around the sides and pin repeat the same for the opposite side also and then make a stitch with quarter inch seam allowance Now flip your binding out and fold the binding twice so that all the raw edges will get hide. Clip them and make a top stitch at 1 8 inch away from the edge of the binding. Do the same for the opposite side also. And lastly unzip it and turn the right side out and your beautiful pencil pouch is ready. Poke the corners, give it a quick press and you're good to go. So friends, if you like today's tutorial then don't forget to like and share it. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then please subscribe to my channel for more such wonderful tutorials. Thank you. Bye-bye.